So I bought these cars recently. I bought uh, three of them from Walmart and two of them uh, from Save a Lot. And uh, let's start off with the ones I got from Save a Lot. I got the Rigor Mortar. It's a 2014 and it's on an international card. Right here you can see. Focus is right. And I got the 69 Ford Mustang Boss 302. It's also an international car. And that, what I have here now, this is the, the United States version, or the U.S. version. It's a little different, you can tell if you follow Hot Wheels. Let's see here. They all have different stuff, like it's not guaranteed for life's not on there. And they're usually in multi-languages on the international version. And uh, they lack information that the American or U.S. versions have. Let's see. Let's uh, open it. We have the Mustang Boss. Next, we got the rigor mode. I had this as a kid, but I think either my brother took it, or I lost it, or maybe sold it on the yard. Well, let's take a good look here. Inside, back, and here we go, the top. See, it looks like a skull in flames on it. That's what they were trying to come. But on a lot of these, you can see there's bats here. This little bat. And there's also these two skulls on the side of each side. I think mo this car is particularly made out of mostly metal. With a few parts like these gold parts are all uh, plastic. And so is this little dome part. Next, we're going to start with the ones I got from Walmart. We got the Rip Rod. This one's for 2015. Let's open. I usually slice my uh, cars out with a box cutter knife so I can. Uh, Save the cards for later use, and it and it uh, doesn't look messed up like how you would normally call it. The rip rod. Let's see. This looks like. Most of this looks like it's plastic. I think it really does look plastic. I think it's, everything's plastic on it. Base. I think. No, I think that might be plastic too. Kind of looks like a Volkswagen Beetle or something. Like maybe a 30s or 40s cut. Next, we got the Harley Davidson uh, Fat Boy. It's also a 2015 car. I'll show you the back. Open it.
one had a little more packing material. I guess to hold it in place better. And here it is. All chromed out. It's Harley Davidson, I think. And the gas tank here and the fender. So there's a plastic seat, I think a plastic handle. And of course, most of these cars have plastic wheels. Sometimes or ever. Good luck. Well, pretty much all this is metal except just the parts I told you about. I think a lot of the motorcycles are usually more metal than plastic. Because they're so small. They could uh, put more metal on it and it wouldn't cost so much. Next we got the bulletproof. Let's take a look first before I rip it. Can I open it? This car is mostly plastic, except maybe the base. The orange wheel. Looks like it's semi transparent, which means you can kind of see through to the interior, through the body. Like, you know, yes, here you can see through. Walmart today. It's a 97 cents car and it, uh, I think it was a Walmart exclusive uh, last year and uh, here's the back and it shows that you could have gotten eight models. So since this was from uh, last year's set I'm kind of late at getting the whole thing but I guess we'll just take a look at it. So here's the front and here's the back made for uh, Marvel Spider-Man and it's called the Eye Candy. Let's open it up. I didn't get this set until I started collecting in uh, September of 2014 so this already came out around May so that's about a year ago since this set originally came out. Uh, here's the car. It says the Green Goblin on it. It's uh, like a pinkish color and uh, green. It's got uh, this. The pink part is plastic, and the uh, this part is all metal here. The green part. So is the engine. Okay, here's the base. And that's it. So I found this the other day at a bookstore. I guess people there they sell stuff and they they got this in. It's a it says Tomart's Price Guide and it's by Hot Wheels. It's a special edition. Not really sure how they got it. I assume like, like um, maybe they were in a club or something. 
but it's made for adult collectors. You can see right here. You can see. And here's the full cover. I'm not going to open this because, you know, it costs $3.99 and it looks good in the package. Well, let's take a closer look at the card. Red interior. And there it says uh, Tomart's price guide. Hot Wheels logo. And all the, the tires, I think, are all uh, real riders. And I think the base is also metal. And it's a 46 Ford. That's it for now.